Winston is currently with Malaika. I feel like that they're always like chilling together, which I love. But anyway, today is Sunday and we're still just trying to, I'm trying to get into the routine of just like taking care of the house and stuff. This house is like actually much bigger than our other house and it's just a new place and like there's been a lot of change. So we're still like kind of getting back into the swing of figuring things out. Um, but today my plan is to just get the house together a little bit um so i thought take you guys along we're gonna spend some family time together as well so you guys can come along for that i'm gonna put my put my to-do list up here as well but i was talking about this on instagram like i always have this tension with to-do lists of either a putting absolutely every single thing on my list broken down because it kind of it feels encouraging to kind of like tick things along as you go compared to when you put like a big item like clean the house you could spend hours doing it and then not feel like you've made progress because you haven't gotten to put that tick on or putting the big things only on because when you actually look at it it feels less overwhelming so i don't know which one are you do you put everything on your to-do list so that you can tick things off or do you just put the big things on your to-do list so you don't feel overwhelmed i kind of try and find a balance of like in between but yeah so the first thing that's on my list is to put the laundry away but first of all i'm gonna i'm gonna hydrate i've already got my water i put it to chill in the freezer but um i'm just gonna put like a little bit of lemon on in it and keep drinking because i don't know i've just been feeling so dehydrated and i notice like when i drink water everything just is a little bit better my skin my energy everything so yeah let's hydrate first already had my coffee and now let's get some let's get some let's get some water down us so my goal is to drink two bottles and then i want to up it to three three liters so let's do that a mess in here i'm not gonna lie this is basically <laughs> where i've been putting the like clean laundry before it needs to be put away so I, I, it will look much better when i put the laundry away so that's what we're gonna do now but also i have big plans for this wardrobe so yeah but let me actually show you what the situation is please no judgment i don't need it <laughs> so this is the wardrobe uh this is the real problem. This is actually clean laundry. So yeah, let's put some clean laundry away. Eventually, like we wanna get a chest of drawers put in here, like a couple more rails and like shelves, but obviously because we're renting, I don't wanna put anything permanent in. So I have to figure out what to do. But yeah, I know it's a mess guys, I know. <laughs> separated all the stuff that needed to go in our wardrobe and then I'm gonna put all the stuff that needs to go to Malika's room and her room but a lot of it is just like towels and stuff so that's gonna go in here which is the current linen cupboard which I also have plans to like revamp a side note I'm looking we're looking for a really good tripod because currently we have this one which I need to return because it's just too short like there were so many issues with it like one it said it was meant to come with like a phone attachment because usually when we're recording I'm trying to create like 
short form content for Instagram and TikTok as well at the same time, but it didn't come with a phone attachment. It has a ring light, but it didn't come with a plug for the ring light. It also said that it was supposed to go up to um, like, I think it was like eight feet. Um, and I'm five two and I'm like, if this is where it would come up to on me, if it was um, actually the right height. Actually, this is okay, but I'm like far away. Um, but anyway, yeah, need to return it. You guys know I'll always put you on if there is a good Amazon find that I buy for this tripod, don't buy it. <laughs> when I get another one, we get another one that actually is good. I'll link that one. We had one in the UK, which we really liked, but I wanted one that was a little bit more lightweight so that if we're out and about filming, we can kind of just pack it and take it with us. Or if we're traveling, we can take it with us, but that one was a bit more heavy duty. So it's really good if we're just filming in the house. But um, yeah, sometimes you need to travel when you're outside the house. Um, but anyway, let me bring, I should probably like, organize this a little bit better yeah it's that stage where like you're you've moved and you're still kind of trying to get the house to a place where everything is like neat and organized so i guess like the first round of like stuff is just getting things functional and then i can do like the pretty organized laundry room and linen cupboard and all of that but let me grab the stuff that actually needs to go in here okay this is the stuff um, I'm just gonna check it up here for now. These are Malika's towels. We'll go in her bathroom. Ugh. Okay, I don't even know how I'm gonna be able to reach that. <laughs> Perfect, but it'll do. Hey chica, hey chica, hey chica, hey chica. Should we change your nappy? Yes, change your nappy. <laughs> I feel like Malika is ready for a walk, so maybe we'll go to Trader Joe's next.
So Malaika is down for it now. I can see her on the monitor, which was really kind of gifted to us from our registry. Whew. She was really fighting that now, but I'm like, girl, just sleep. Like, there's gonna come a time where you can't just sleep whenever you want to. But anyway, she's down. So I'm gonna do a quick Trader Joe's haul. And then my next task is to clean and organize the kitchen. I mean, it's not like untidy or like, actually it is there. It's like, it, it needs like a deep clean, like properly like mopping and sweeping and spraying down the fridge and stuff. But it's like not a complete mess. Um, anyway, from Trader Joe's, I got some, so these have so many names, I feel like. I've heard them referred to as baby breath. Um, and here it says Geosophilia. I don't know if that's the name of the plant, but anyway, I got these, um, which I think will look really cute in um, a vase in one of the in one of the bathrooms. And then I got this little plant. Yeah, it's like a little succulent, which I'm thinking of putting right by the kitchen sink. Uh, got some peppers my plan this week is I'm trying to be a bit more organized like with what I'm making for dinner and stuff um, so I try and buy ingredients where I can use them for more than one dish so we're making tacos on Tuesday but then we're also going to make bolognese as well um, and I can use the peppers for both otherwise I just find that like fresh produce just goes to waste got some baby broccoli which will be nice with um, chicken or salmon got some blueberries to have with oats um, and I don't know I might try making like some kind of blueberry muffin for Malaika basically we started off doing purees like with her food but now she's just not interested in purees like she just wants to be able to like touch things herself and try and feed herself but yeah if you have any tips with that let me know because i kind of feel like i think it's good that she's interested in food because as i've heard the whole point in like solids for the first kind of year is less about the nutrition because they get what they need from milk and more about them actually learning how to eat but then like in the back of my head i'm like oh like is she actually getting enough like I don't know because obviously she's still learning there's some foods that she's really good at eating and there's other foods that um um she doesn't eat so much of <laughs> even though she tries um oh and I got black beans as well for chicken tacos that I'm gonna make later in the week I got some salmon salmon is just my favorite kind of fish if you didn't know I just feel like it's so easy to make it tastes delicious every time and you don't have to do much to it to taste delicious. Uh, I got this cleaning spray, which I bought randomly before when I went to Trader Joe's and it's just amazing. I got some smoked salmon for breakfast. There's another one that I bought, which comes in like a bigger packet, which I kind of would have preferred, but Winston didn't really like that one. So I thought I would try this one. This is oak smoked, which I think is more similar to the one that we have in the UK. And then I got some cheeky moscato ash tea which this just tastes the bomb it's delicious and we've got a friend coming over later so that'd be quite nice to do um, but that's pretty much it i went to target yesterday where i got like most of like the the other foods for the week week to week i just try not to be like crazy excessive otherwise i feel like things just kind of go to waste but at the same time it's obviously nice to have you know Bless you. Thank you. It's nice to have food in the house because it was, makes it way easier to actually like be healthy and choose good options. So uh, yeah, that's what we got. So what have you been up to? I've been uh, booking some flights for a trip, that, a trip that we have coming up and hanging out with Malaika for a bit mm -hmm. before you guys went shopping. Yeah, she was literally fighting sleep. She She's refused. Now. I thought she was just going to watch a bit of TV and then knock out, but she didn't want to. Yeah. Um, but yeah, today is pretty much a lazy day for me as well. Got a friend coming over later. Mm -hmm. But priority is just to get organized for the week. 
Yeah. So that's what we're doing. I'm just gonna go freshen up and then eat something maybe. Hello, hello, Sifam. Hi, how do you do? Malaika has been doing this thing where she pretends to cry. What you can hear in the background sounds like a baby crying. As soon as I approach her, she stops crying. In fact, she'll even start laughing. Let me show you. Oh, I'm coming, baby. I'm coming. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm sorry I left you for five seconds. How you do? You okay? Ah! I, I told them you were gonna do that. I already told them. They know your true colors now. Okay? No more fake crying. Um, so I'm actually downstairs down in the club room which is this really cool space I think we showed you a little bit of the club room when we did uh, the empty house tour a few weeks ago but the reason that I'm here is just to catch up with a bit of work um, so like we probably mentioned a few times I think majority 90% of our work is home based so we're really fortunate that we get to, to work from home, which allows us to, you know, align our schedules in a way that suits us and a way that allows us to be available for, for Malika as well. So that's really cool. And I think the only part of our work that is not home-based is maybe the speaking. So I do speaking when I work with organizations or I speak at events. So. If that is the case that I do get get booked to speak in person, then obviously I'd have to travel to the location. But pretty much all the other work that we do on social media and YouTube and all that kind of stuff is home based. So anyway, I'm here to just catch up with some tasks that I've been meaning to do for a little while. There's some emails that need my responses. So I'm just going to do this for a bit and then we're going to go back upstairs and hang out with Mayfair and Malaika for the evening. All right, let's get this work done. Malaika should be in bed, so we're still in with her, trying to get her to. And in the meantime, I've been making dinner. Um, I made teriyaki chicken, some broccoli, and some brown rice. Um, it was actually really simple to do. Um, I don't really have a recipe, but if you guys want more recipes, let me know. Um, yeah, I just roasted the broccoli in the oven, cooked the brown rice, and then the chicken, I just seasoned it a little bit, 
and then added a teriyaki sauce that I got from Target. Let me actually show you guys. This is the sauce that I used and you can get it from, from Target. Excited to just eat and chill. Like I've literally spent ages cleaning the house and I'm really happy with like how it looks. I'll do like a proper tour in a bit. But um, obviously I've just been cooking so it's gotten a bit messy. But yeah, ready to eat, ready to hang out with Winston. Um, and yeah, get some rest. I'm gonna have a shower and get some rest. Um, I look a mess, hence why. <laughs> you guys can see everything else in me. Speaks a thousand words. You can't see it properly, but good job, Papa. You ready to eat? I'm ready to eat. Let's do it.